And the dropping temperatures put your home at risk this winter, too. We're working to help you prevent freezing pipes. Kristen Escal live to show you how to protect your home's plumbing during these frigid nights. And Brooke, experts say doing a few little things can make a big difference, like leaving cabinets open underneath sinks and keeping sinks running just at a drip to keep the water flowing through the pipes. Now, plumbers say the cold weather brings a lot of business. This is what it looks like when the pipes are pumping water properly. But if the faucet turns on and no water is coming out, you could have a problem. Cindy Bateman is all too familiar with the problems of frozen pipes. It was a mess. Our uh, part of our basement flooded. Plumbing companies say that kind of problem keeps them busy once the temperature drops below 30 degrees. We're preparing more service guys to work longer hours, to take more calls. Nathan Patterson is vice president of Correct Plumbing, Heating, and Air Conditioning. He says the pipes most at risk are those near the outside walls of the home. That's where insulation, leaving cabinets open, and keeping water running at a drip come in handy. Moving water doesn't freeze as quick as, as water that's still, so that helps it prolong the freezing process. Patterson also says people shouldn't be afraid to turn the heat up. If the home is warmer, um, as opposed to turning the thermostat down to save a little bit, it, it could actually be better for the plumbing in the long run. Patterson says it's a good idea to know where your home's water shutoff valve is, so you can lessen damage from a leak. Cindy Bateman says she and her husband are trying to make sure that doesn't happen to them again. Last night he opened the doors underneath the kitchen sink and downstairs around the furnace. And if it gets really bad, he will run the faucets dripping. And experts say outside it's important to keep your hose off the faucet so that you don't have any problems in the spring when you try to turn it on. They also say it's important to keep your home properly insulated. Reporting live, Kristen Eskow, 2 News, working for you.